This video is about the tawny mining bees that I have in my front garden. I noticed these holes a few years ago after grassing the area. The ground tends to be quite dry and between April and May there are times when it can be really busy with bees trying to nest in the area. I've told people about them in the past and there are instances when people have asked me if I'm sure. I think a lot of people don't expect bees to mine or make a home in the ground. So my aim was to capture them emerging and going down into the holes. I did manage to do this, but was hoping for some better footage. I did set the camera up with a tripod capturing two holes, but unfortunately, despite setting it off for over 90 minutes, the best I got was one coming out to take a look. I did manage to capture one coming out in the end, although it is a bit shaky. I also caught one trying to find its hole, whether they can smell which one's theirs I don't know. From what I've heard they use wood in order to build their nests. Near to this area I have made a fence out of a silver birch tree that was getting a bit too large in the front garden. I noticed that they have pretty much hollowed out one of the horizontals nearby. You do see them on there regularly, to me it always looked like they were resting, but maybe they were consuming it in some way. So if you're wanting to encourage mining bees to your garden, it may be worth selecting an area that's south facing, has good drainage and maybe have a source of wood nearby. You could always leave an area of your garden that is grass free in order to encourage them to nest there. We need to look after our bees and a great way to do this is to encourage tawny mining bees into your garden. They're great pollinators and although they do sting, it's not strong enough to pierce human skin. So they are safe to have in family gardens too. Thanks for watching and feel free to check out my other videos.